Hey everyone, JSD Cool here, and welcome to another episode of Cool Crap Season 2. Now, today in this episode is probably been a while since the last video on this channel because I've just been super lazy. And also, I will say I barely did anything on my storage system in between episodes. I mean, I put the line of hoppers around the top, but that's about it because I was distracted by playing Planet Coaster for some reason. Anyhow, so today in this episode, we are not actually going to be working in my base. I don't think at all. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be working here at all. So what I'm actually going to be doing is we are going to be working in the nether today. On the uh, face that you saw title, title and thumbnail today, we are going to be building a gold farm. Because one of the problems that has been plaguing me and probably other people on the server for a little while now is besides the lack of firework rockets, the lack of experience to repair stuff with. Which means that we're less willing to go out and use our stuff and and die to, and lose our levels because it's hard to get them back. Now, that should not, that problem should be no more. Because today, we are building a gold farm. Now, in between episodes, I did mine up here, mine up this room, punch a hole through this bedrock, and start building up. But, yeah, you know, you know I mean, would you guys really want... No, would you guys... Oh, would you really want to see that? Really? Anyhow, so yeah, I've so far built this tower up to where we're going to start building the gold farm. And now... Because I'm just stalling for time as I'm going up this ladder, it's really good time to mention that this farm was was made by Ill Mango with slight modification. Actually, I don't think I'm really modifying this at all besides the materials that I'm using. Yeah, because I'm just using his fix that he made for 1.13 plus. But yeah, so um, yeah, almost up to the top here. You know, same farm that I built last season. I forget. Oh yeah, I did have an episode of it. I hated it. Um, but yeah. And this season we're using anvils for the um for letting two by t the the two pigmen in together. That 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 that's exciting. Anyhow, we have reached the top. I just realized I have like no oak planks on me. <laughs> Which one of these? This one. Um, let's grab a stack of planks. Um, don't lose that. Yes, build up. Over here now that, that should be technically concrete. I just for some reason didn't change the schematic there But yeah, let's get right into a replay of me building this Alright guys, was that a great time lapse? I built up most of this farm actually. Um, but now I just wanted to quickly clarify something. I put a command block around here in the time lapse. I was mainly to prevent gas spawning because I mean I'm pretty sure in El Mango's tutorial he had like something about how you prevent gas spawnings before you build the top layer, but obviously I was not following the tutorial this time as I did last time. And I must say, this took way it took me way less time to build it this time rather than it did last season, because I just used a schematic, which is so much better, but the hard part, which is getting these guys here, is still to come. I also gotta put the iron golems, but that shouldn't be that hard. But, specifically, after the time lapse, I put the snow layers here, I put in these anvils, because I actually went back and got some iron. And, oh yeah, I got carpets here, so I don't have to um, deal with the red boxes for these buttons. Yes, I'm stalling for time here. Anyhow, um, so now what I gotta go do is I'm gonna go put in the mine carts. That's gonna be a pain, but... Um, I got this shulker box full of iron here. 
Let's put that on there just so that no mobs spawn on top of these shulker boxes. Because they could spawn on shulker boxes, apparently. Ooh. Anyhow, yeah, let, let's, let's get the stuff in. Alright guys, so I put in all the hopper minecarts and entity cramming minecarts. So now all that's left to do is, one, make iron golems, and two, put in all the alarm pig- Oh no. But luckily I can just, um, steal a whole bunch of eggs from the aprons guy, whoever, to uh, be able to anger the pigmen, so that'll be nice. Like, I would just instantly resort to going to steal those egg to steal eggs from somebody to do that. Uh, I know in the rules book it does say no stealing, but to be honest, it's more petty theft than anything. And with that, all the pigmen and iron golems are in this season. And I was actually able to do it without cheating this season. I mean, um, actually, I totally, it's totally the second time that I ever did that completely in survival, you know? And their name tag, I, at least I think I've name tagged. Hold up, I gotta go check this little group over here to make sure I name tag them. But yeah, that should have said, yeah, I did, okay. Um, but yeah, that should essentially be this farm complete, apart from a storage system which Jared Cool has said he's going to build, so hopefully we can get that done. And this video I know is like super short, but, um,. I'll, I'll find something else to do, like maybe st start to build a gold shop. Actually, I gotta put this little piece of wall in here, and then I'm safe. So let's go beep, beep, beep. Um, this piece of glass is irrelevant now. And uh, now what I have to do is, uh, these shulker boxes can be removed, by the way. I can also go turn off the schematic currently. And then, just go. Hopefully I don't insta-kill this guy. Nope. Perfect. Perfect. Got all the pigmen here, guys, and things are about to get good. And by that, I mean stuff is about to get is about to go down. Yeah. Woo. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, okay, guys. Um, hold up. Give me a sec. All right, guys. Now that that is done, and Jared Equal has to put in the storage system, I gotta get working on my storage system here because um. Well, I need- well, this is getting- is starting to get a little bit out of hand. I know there's like eight shulker boxes here, but trust me, this is getting a little bit ridiculous. So, I essentially need to go on a leather ga gathering session so I can start putting item frames on these chests, and therefore start sorting them. I'll also try to sort them in like groups, so like put all the valuables and stuff here, um, you know, all like redstone components together. I have to do all that stuff, but yeah, I first gotta go on a leather gathering session, so yeah, I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I'm wandering around in fields here that are north of spawn, and I've been finding some random fence posts about, and now I find this. I, I'm confused as to what this, this exactly is, but uh, it looks like some sort of humanoid structure with a pumpkin for a head. I mean, there's the Golden Creepers village right there, but what the hell is this? Man. I, like, not knowing when people are on and what they do is nice, so I can just go to their base and then randomly see random progress that has happened. <laughs> like, whatever the heck this thing is, I actually have never seen it. I've been to the Golden Creepers base over here many a time, just looking around, maybe dropping a few chickens in his base. But, you know, never, never been over this way enough to see that. <laughs> and anyway, yeah, uh, back to the leather collecting. Alright, so, uh, yeah, I just found something else here that I'm confused about. Like, a whole bunch, some wooden planks in the swamp randomly. I'm not actually too sure where I am right now. Oh, there's some lava here. Um, but yeah, I have, uh, two stacks and 19 leather. I think I need three stacks? I'm too unsure about that. And I also don't, I also think I left my axe in one of the shulker boxes that I, that I had for the gold farm. Ah, oh, man. I'm impressed that I was able to build that in less than a day. Last season, the gold farm took ages for me to make, because I had to build it by hand and follow Mingo's stupid tutorials. But yay! Oh, uh, anyhow, uh, get back to killing animals. Alright guys, so I managed to scrounge up three stacks of wild leather, and, a ho and I've gotten a whole bunch of items from now, and this should be enough to cover my entire system here. Um, which means I can get started adding filter items to this. Now, sorry this episode isn't coming out Sunday. It's probably going to come out Monday now that I think about it. Um, then again, my schedule last I knew did say Sunday, Monday, even though I've been sticking to doing just Sunday. So yeah, I think that'll be fine. I actually don't have anything for Wednesday, though, so 
Maybe I'll have Jared E. Cool pump out an episode, or maybe I have an episode of his that I haven't edited yet. I don't know. Yeah, but as you can see, I just ran out of one sec there. So yeah, let me get this and start um sorting stuff, and I'll get right back. All right, everybody. So I have put in, I have put in filter items. I can't remember how I talked about this yet, but if I have, oops. But something I've also done is I put in the shulker boxes for the um shulker box loaders here, or at least some. We don't have any oops shulker boxes um here yet, but it's time to going this way back around through here which I for some reason have an item filter on the miscellaneous chest which is confusing me I will start to try to group items by putting them through and if I think I should leave like a space for items I will so yeah I'll get back to you maybe in a day or so once I got this all done all right guys so I have started laying out some of the items in the storage system at hand I'm, and I'm now just like going through some of my shulker boxes dumping the items into the storage system randomly and then just seeing what items will just end up in the random chest at the end and then going to go sort those so it's an interesting process but yeah I think it'll work so yeah um, let me sit here for a while while these guys run through the system and I'll be right back alright guys well I have sorted out a few more things here and I filtered in fact like the entire half of my storage system I think I've sorted through so I've yeah I've sorted through this like this entire face of my storage system of this storage system here with items, of course apart from, from all the shulker boxes and stuff. And yeah, I feel like that's gonna be about it for this episode today because I don't know what else I I want to do too much and I kind of gotta go and um edit this episode and get it uploaded and stuff. For at this point it is Monday, so yeah um I'm gonna have to say. Thank you all for watching, hope you enjoyed, please make sure to like and subscribe, check out the Discord linked in the description, and I will see you all in the next episode of Cool Crap Season 2. Bye!